We're back live, Portland Sports Arena, 8725 North Chautauqua, and we hope that you're going to be joining us very soon, or that you'll be going to see the action down at Salem, uh, Eugene, Cedro Woolley, Everett, wherever it might be, folks watching us on cable. Ticket information, we're getting some calls again about Tuesday. Where do you get your tickets? Okay, on a Tuesday card. Here's the way it happens. We'll explain it one, one more time. 289-4222 is the phone number, 289-4222. And that number will not do you any good except for Sunday, tomorrow during the day, and Tuesday during the day. No one answering uh, that phone tonight, nor is there anyone answering that phone on Monday. You have to call it by 289-4222 uh, between 9 o'clock and 5 o'clock Sunday or Tuesday from 9.30 or 10 o'clock until fight time as long as the tickets last. And then you have to have you pick up your tickets by 8 o'clock Tuesday night. The only other way of getting tickets is to come out to the sports arena tomorrow during Sandy Bar's flea market. Uh, that opens at 8 o'clock in the morning. is over about 4 or 5 at night. Come out, go to the concession stand. Come into the market. Go to the concession stand. See Bill over there, and he'll fix you up with pretty good uh, reserved seats. You pay for the tickets, then you have them in your hand, and when you come out here Tuesday, no standing in line. That is the ticket information. On Saturday cards, if you want next Saturday, the only way is to call uh, the same things. Make reservations at that number I told you about. Saturday night, we're going to have a big over-the-top battle royal for a $1,000 prize purse to the winner and five other matches, so we'll have a real hot one here next Saturday night. And for next Saturday only, we're going to Give the kids a break, and there'll be a ch child admitted with each paid adult admission next Saturday night. So bring the kids and come on down. And also, Tuesday night, we've definitely scheduled at Lonnie Main's request a street fight where there are no rules. Everything goes. Goes until one man is unconscious or quits. And Lonnie Main has requested that the referee sit on the floor and not even get in the ring because everything's going to go. How come everything's going Lonnie Main's way? This is my town right here. Ladies and gentlemen, the next event will be the best two out of three falls on a TV time limit. Introducing in this corner, 245 pounds, Las Vegas Playboy Buddy Roll. His opponent in this corner, 275 pounds, from Salt Lake City, the blonde bomber, Lonnie May. Out of Salt Lake City, or the adopted home of Portland, Oregon, Moondog. Moondog me, no matter what happens here tonight in this one, and incidentally, we are very glad that the main event being brought to you at the urging of our sponsors. And with his robe still on, watch out, with his robe still on, going with the bombs away, Lonnie Main. One, two, three, and the first ball is over. The first ball is over. Buddy Rose never got his robe off. Buddy Rose never got his robe off. He took a wild swing at Lonnie Main. Miss. And that was all it took. In fact, he came up behind Lonnie. As Lonnie ducked, he just lifted up and had him on his shoulders. Body slammed him, went to the top rope, came with a flying knee drop that he calls the bombs away. And sick in the ring, actually sick in the ring from that action, Buddy Rose. And Maine wants some more of him. Maine out after him, and I'll tell you, I have seen Maine upset before, but never like this. Rose, 
A man who's becoming known for his crippling tactics. Not beating men, not giving them physical pain, but actually crippling them. And Woskowski's out of his dressing room, yelling at Maine to stay back. Maine says, oh, I'll take you on right here. Rose taking his robe off. And he's had a bad knee. And Lonnie, Lonnie and Woskowski arguing at ringside. We better just hold it right here. Lonnie Main rushing around the ring. Sandy Barr trying to break it up. He gets there before Wiskowski and Main can get at it. Rose heading for the dressing room. Lonnie Main down at ringside saying nothing personal. Shaking hands with referee Sandy Barnes saying, I just want that man so bad, I can taste it. Well, let's get things put together as Lonnie, the popular choice of the whole world as he picks up a little girl and walks back into the crowd with her. One of the most popular wrestlers I've seen anywhere, anytime. Lonnie Mean and one of the wildest. And the first fall is all that's happened, so there's a lot more to be expected. Don't you dare go away. Right now, let's take a quick look at where the action is coming up in the next week or so. And remember, if you have a piece of paper and a pencil or pen handy, I hope you write it down. A lot of times you think, oh, I won't be able to go next week or I'm not interested. And then you find out you are and you don't remember where the action is. So very quickly, nothing tomorrow. Monday night, Yakima, J.M. Perry Institute. Tuesday night, the great big one here at Portland. It'll be no matter what happens tonight, it'll be... Uh, uh, Maine and Rose in a street fight. Anything goes. Everett, a great big one there. Big grudge match in Everett. Uh, Thursday, Salem, the Grand Theater Northwest Tag Team match. Classy newcomer Gina Hernandez on that card as well as the rest of them. Hernandez also on the card at Eugene when they decide who gets the heavyweight championship. It's been held up between Bass and uh, Savage. They'll meet again for the title Friday. Gino Hernandez on that card. Next big pro mat card in Roseburg on Tuesday, October 11th. Next Saturday here in Portland, it is Kids Night. A big 10-man over-the-top battle royal for $1,000 prize money. So a lot of things are happening. Tuesday night, a big one here at the Sports Arena. Could be an all-time record crowd. We'll be back in just a moment. Now, again, one of the people makes our show possible. We couldn't do it without sponsors like this one. When it comes to stereo, we at Tom Peterson's have the best deal in town. And you can choose any of these stereo systems for only $25 a month. That's right, only $25 a month. Choose system number one, a JVC receiver, a BSR turntable, four-way Ultratech speakers, only $3.99. System number two, Sansui receiver, Gerard turntable, Zonic speakers, only $3.39. System number three, Pioneer Receiver, Gerard Turntable, Fisher Speakers, only 466. System number four, Saniel Receiver, JVC Turntable, Jensen Speakers, only 419. System number five, Rotel Receiver, Dual Turntable, Fisher Speakers, only 388. System number six, Fisher Receiver, BSR turntable, KL8 speakers, only 433. Yes, buy any of these stereo systems for only $25 a month. That's right, only $25 a month. And your first payment is not due until 45 days after purchase. If you prefer shorter terms, 105 days the same as cash. No interest, no carrying charges. Yes, when it comes to stereo components, there's only one place to buy them, and that's Tom Peterson's. 